So in this video, we'll talk about how to make a call uh, option calculator. Uh, so basically, we'll define the uh, values uh, for strike price uh, and the stock price and we'll simulate the value of stock and see how much profit we can make the stock goes up or down, right? So let me start with the value of a strike price. So K is the strike price and uh, let's call it uh, as uh, 600 and uh, then the stock price itself uh, is equal to maybe 600 so let's let's assume it to be 600 right now and uh, then the premium of uh, uh, this uh, call option uh, is equal to maybe 20 dollars right so i have now all this uh, three uh, variables now uh, let's simulate the value of stock so this is a stock price so let's call it price and uh, the stock price uh, let's start uh, with the uh, uh, 300 or, or we can start with zero so because that's that's easy and then we can have an increment of uh, one dollar each so if we do that uh, we can go until uh, pretty long like let's go until uh, oh I did a mistake let's go up again and uh, let me write here this is equal to 0 plus 1 and then all the way down so this is the stock price right uh, now here we have uh, the value of the call option So the value of call option will depend on uh, where the strike price is. So we have to say is equal to if stock price is greater than strike price. So this is a and we can put a dollar sign here so that when we change the cell, the reference will not move. Uh, so if this is true, what should happen? Then the profit is equal to uh, stock price minus strike price again i put a dollar sign here go and put a dollar sign here and uh, if it's not uh, above the strike price then the profit is zero and then i close the bracket so this is the uh, value of the call option so now i can uh, just drag it down the same way or, or i can just move it here and then I can drag it down so now you can say that uh, uh, move this here here yep. let me move this like this so now you can see that uh, these are all zeros so the value of the call is zero until I reach the stock price until I reach the strike price and now when I reach the strike price of uh, 600 and the value is zero but when it becomes 601 I I I make one dollar and now you can see that uh, it's keep going up like this so so I can I can do some more simulations so um, I can also drag it down to see some more numbers so this is how the call option value will look like however I paid premium for it so my total profit will be equal to uh, call option value of call option minus the premium I paid so this is the premium and now I can say dollar here so now I'm losing $20 and then again I can move this here to this and move it here so now you can see that I'm losing the money all the way but when it goes to the strike price then I'll start to uh, recover my losses and eventually when it goes higher then it starts to make money so this is how it will look like so now i all i need to do is uh, go to menu and say insert chart and uh, select data add it and choose uh, stock price on the x-axis so I'll, I'll choose this
and uh, and for the y axis uh i'll choose the same uh i'll choose the profit so the profit is in e column so i'll just replace this by e say okay and send okay so this is the chart my profit chart and uh, i can call uh this as stock price and uh, this has profit and then i can zoom out a little bit uh, or i can also make this chart a little smaller and now you can see that uh, i have my uh, uh profit chart so now if i'm looking at this chart i can change the values i can move the stock price uh initial stock price to be uh 500 so it doesn't matter because it doesn't matter where my stock price starts from what matter is what my strike price is so if i change the strike price to 30 300 maybe then you can see that the chart moves but if i move it to 700 then i will have profit at a much higher prices and same way for the premiums if my premium is 100 dollars then uh, i'll take much more time to recover and make the profits but if my premium is uh, at uh, uh, lower or like 10 dollars then i'll more likely to make profits so this is uh, how you make a chart for uh, a call option and a profit chart and you can play around with this and this is also good for uh, just for the concept uh, 